We can make the world stop We can make the world stop and start again We can make the world stop The problem that you've all got with coming to see a, a folk singer is that that makes you part of a folk audience and when you're part of a folk audience it carries certain duties and obligations and those duties and obligations are to sing along and also to stamp your feet and whack the table and, and generally act a bit daft. So uh, we're going to get that all out of the way in the very first song. It's called The Ship Song and it's got a chorus that you can sing along to and it's dead easy. It just goes like this. Na, 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 na. Let's find out. Here we go. Louder. And again, louder. That was excellent, actually. It was much better than I expected. But the, the first law of pantomime is that whatever you do first time round, you can do at least three times louder next time round. So let's go again. Sing. Wonderful. Now this particular song has got a horrible character in it called Sir Desmond. And we don't like Sir Desmond very much at all. Like most people who are Sir Something, he got his knighthood for horrible reasons. But he does get his comeuppance at the end of the song. Now, we can be very gracious about that if we choose to. I choose not to. I don't know about you. And so what I want you to do on the final chorus is regress to the age of about six years when you were six and your mate had an ice cream, what happened is that he'd drop his and you, you should basically say, like Rolf Harris and his two little boys, don't worry mate, I've got some ice cream on my cone that you can have. But you don't, because you're six years of age and you're a bit mean-spirited. So instead we do what we're going to do to Sir Desmond and we go... Remember that for the last chorus, I want to see tongues being pulled and everything. Sir Desmond was a wealthy man, a leader of the fold. He'd win respect and influence on account of his bags of gold. He said, I want to see the world before my bones grow old. So he got a ticket on a sailing ship, his treasures to behold. Jim Jenkins was a lowly man, a toiler from the town. He'd work each day for men of our pay, all the whole year round. He said, I want to see the world, the fate should cut me down. So he got a job on a sailing ship and left the solid ground. Now this is your bit coming up. Let's see you sing. Here we go. Wonderful. Upon a narrow ship deck, saw a meeting of the two. So Desmond barked, get out my way and let your better through. She said, what makes you think that I'm a lesser man than you? So he weighed his money in the air and pushed his way on through. To Desmond in his cabin he was building up a stack While counting out his shiny coins he heard an awful crack He gathered up his money and returned it to its sack The next thing he knew the ship was through and laying on her back Breathe in now cause I want to hear you really boom it out Here we go Now remember next time is going to be the Pulling Songs version of the chorus. Almost no one from that ship was ever seen again. 
A distant desert island say two very different men One came ashore with a bag of gold The other some food and men Both could see the destinies were meant to cross again Sir Desmond said I'm hungry and I really must implore For you to share some food with me I need a little more Jim said what's wrong with your bag of gold you are pleased with that before Ha! Seems that I'm the rich man now You're the one who's poor Get your tongues ready to pull everybody Here we go! Thank you very much. You make a fantastic folk audience. We can make the world stop. We can make the world stop and start again. We can make the world stop.